have detected what appears to be an ancient guide to log chopping that might be useful for the Lumberjack games. Unfortunately, it's frozen deep in an ice wall. How are we supposed to get to it? Wait for more global warming? That industrial laser is used to cut through petrified logs. If it could be bounced out that window, with your help, I should be able to harness its energy to melt the ice wall and free the book. How do I redirect that thing? There should be a switch on the other side of this wall. Throw it and then head outside. On the other side of this wall. Well, I don't think it's going to be that easy of just crawling through. Nope. There's the switch. There's a guard. Guard doesn't have an item. Okay, so we'll kill that guy. Alright, well, this is very reminiscent of the first game. Except for instead of lasers, they use spotlights. Or maybe there was a... Okay, yeah, this is hot. Let me up. Thank you. Or maybe they did use lasers at... No, they would have used lasers at one point. Okay, let's see how this works. I don't like any of this. We got a sleeping guard there. We got a guard moving around there. A sleeping guard there. What do I have equipped? Thief reflexes. Okay. Well, I can't throw the alarm clock from here. So let's go deal with this guy. All right. That was easy. We'll deal with the awake one now. And now we'll deal with the sleeping one. Ow. That hurt. All right, but that should be everyone. Well, maybe except for the guard. Oh, no. Yeah. Ooh, hey, the vault. If I did my math right, and I always do my math right, then the combination has got to be five, eight, three. All right, what do we get? Ooh, that looks fun. Lightning spin. Gadzooks, that's a nice one. Heh. <laughs> I was oh can I can I like glitch into that? Cause I see the, I see the purpley stuff. Holy crap! I did. <laughs> That's awesome. There's an item there. I I can't. Oh crap. Oh maybe it's just a lantern. Oh it is just a lantern. Well there. I can't believe that I actually did that. Holy jeez. That's cool. We just we just skipped a good portion of the level. Well, that was accidental. But there's nothing important in here cuz we got the <laughs> we got the thing. Holy crap. <laughs> anyway, lightning spin. Uh I don't know, R2. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> Wow, I can't believe that actually worked. I wasn't even trying. Like, I, well, I was trying, obviously. But, like, it wouldn't have made a difference whether or not it happened. But, hey, I found a glitch. Now, to get that laser pointed at the ice wall, you'll need to alter its direction with the crystals I put in your pouch. I see. I just walked to where the laser stops. Place a crystal and it'll bounce the beam to a new position. That log chopping book is as good as ours. But doesn't doing things like this diminish the power of. Ah, Jesus. Uh, like diminish the power of the laser as it goes through more crystals? 
Or am I just thinking completely different things here? Oh, what if happens if I hit the laser? Oh, it's hot. <laughs> I just had to check. All right, we're going to do this. And we're going to do this. All right, where is... Oh, it's right up there. All right, perfect. Oh, well, um... Huh. That worked. I don't think it was supposed to, but it did. Why doesn't that one fall? All right. Um, so jump over. Do this. Jump back down. All right. And then to here. Jesus. And I'm assuming we have to, like, get it to aim at the mammoth. Or something. I'm assuming that's where the, uh, book is. Is with the mammoth. Well, nice and easy walk. No item there, so we don't need to worry about it. Gotta dodge the uh, bear, though. Okay. Easy. How about, you know, you, you, you angle it towards, like, closer to where the uh, book is. Instead of doing this, I'm just gonna go around the entire level. Oh, come here. You have an item. I'm not letting you leave. Ah! Gross. What happened? Oops. <laughs> uh, I kind of feel bad, but I kind of don't. All right. Oh, Jesus. I have no idea where this one landed. Is it on this roof here? Nope, it went past it. Right? Yep, it went past it. Okay, so it's up here. Alright. Ah, oh, Jesus. Ah! More of this crap. That didn't help. Okay, so it saves me here. That's actually kind of nice. Uh, now I need to get back up to on top of the saw blade building. All right. Well, crap. All right. Well, that made it simple to get by. How many more crystals do I need to put? Yeah. Honestly, this could have been done in such a different way. Free, how do you up, freeze pal. again? We got the log chopping guide. 74. Where did he go? The mammoth just came out of there. Came over this way. Ooh, you have an item. Let me take that item. No, 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 I'm taking that, Ruby. Thank you. Where, where'd Mr. Mammoth go? I don't see him. Oh, they just didn't want to have a mammoth running around causing havoc, because that would have been fun. Oh, you have an item. 
You have an item. Let me take it. I'll take your allowance for the week. Woo! Tiny nugget. Yay. Alright, I need a Murray. And I also need to, you know, sell my crap. Because I have a lot of stuff. Probably going to be at five grand, maybe. There we go. Over five grand. All right, Murray. How do I get up there with you? Oh, I could do the high jump. Oh, bad idea. Well, that made it. This works as well. 51, 52. Rumor has it that several off-duty guards meet in that cabin for an RC combat club. This is going to be great. I haven't been in any RC combat since that job we pulled in Istanbul. It was awesome. <laughs> All right. I kind of wish we got to uh, see the... RC car combat in Istanbul. Yeah, you can live, Ms. Moose. Ms. Moose. Yeah, that works. Those guards will never let you into the combat club without a disguise. That old moose head should do the trick. Only there's no way for you to get up there. Hide out in this barrel. Yes, Murray will fit in the barrel. I'm amazed. But okay. Sly, if you can get the stuffed moose head without being detected, Murray should be able to join the RC Combat Club without raising any suspicion. Alright, well, we'll do this. Fighting with a guard fails this stealth job. I was killing him stealthily, though. Fine. We'll do it like this. Between you two. And then... Well, that didn't work the way that I wanted it to. Okay, just walk around. I'm not entirely sure where we're supposed to go. I'm going to assume back here. Bunch of liquor bottles. Alright. Um, hmm. Well, that was easier said than done. Alright. We'll put this guy to sleep. There we go. <laughs> Murray, heads up. I am just I'm making this game a lot easier on myself. Hey fellas, any of you guys think you can beat the mur the, the moose? Maybe put a bet on it. Oh, I'm in, eh? I ain't got a lot of money for this wager, but there's no way I'd lose to a new guy like you, huh? All right. Why didn't I get a trophy? There it is. Ah. Oh, wow. He got me. Ha! Ah, I flipped him. Ah. Uh -huh. There we go. Did I win? You won, eh? But I ain't got no money. That might be okay. It all depends. Depends on what? On whether or not you know the location of the Northern Light Battery. Oh, well, I guess I owe you. 
He's not even talking. <laughs> but okay, I'll take it. Who's filming us? After reading through the log shopping guide, it's become painfully clear that to win in the lumberjack games, we'll have to cheat. Now I've constructed a plan that hinges around us acquiring an eagle's egg, which is more difficult than you'd think. First, Murray needs to lure a bear into taking out the local oil mains. Once destroyed, the pressurized oil should ignite and create updrafts, which Sly will then use to paraglide over to the eagle's nest, grab an egg, and then head back to the safe house. Thanks to Murray's undercover work in the RC Combat Club, we've learned that the Northern Light Battery is hidden in a silo nearby. The battery needs some serious modification if we're going to hide inside it to sneak onto Arpeggio's blimp. First, we'll short the battery with grapple lines on local boats. Then, we'll all break into the lighthouse and sever the power flow to the battery. That way it won't recharge. Given my electrical engineering background, this plan has a 97% chance of success. Pretty good, huh?